Salam and welcome back to another very exciting Photoshop tutorial. My name is Visha and today I'm going to try and explain uh, how to do the glow effect in Photoshop very quickly. This is how I do it and um, it's, it's going to be really easy. So watch the video until the end to fully understand. Okay, so let's begin. Alright, so to begin with, we have three layers, um, the PS layer, I have separated this and there's the square and then there's the background. So to start off, uh, we are going to click the background layer and we're going to go down here and click this button and we're going to go to solid color and this will create a sort of a new solid color layer above. Uh, the background which is exactly what we want um, and uh, we're gonna select we're gonna give it maybe a dark gray not the not fully black maybe a bluish um, dark gray yeah something like that okay so this is good um, let's click OK the next thing we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna select uh, the PS layer and right click it and go to blending options and we're gonna go to color overlay just click here and we're gonna give it white click here and give it white the reason we are giving it a white color is because um, any uh, light source that glows in the dark usually appears white at the center of the source um, if that makes sense so um, the next thing we're going to do is uh, we're going to give it uh, maybe uh, an outer glow and it will look something like this. So you're going to go here and you're going to select maybe uh, like bluish color, something like that and click OK. And we're going to go to blend mode and click normal and we are going to increase the opacity like that and increase the size something like that click OK the next thing you can do is um, you can go down here and click this um, button again and go to solid color and we're gonna select the same color maybe like something like that click OK and we're gonna select this um, mask layer and hit ctrl i on your keyboard that will invert the mask the next thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna select the brush tool and take a maybe normal brush something like this and select 35 percent opacity you can press alt on your keyboard and right click and drag your mouse left and right to resize your brush and i'm gonna start painting on the mask not the layer you can't paint on the layer on the mask with white color so let's go ahead and decrease the brush size a little bit more or maybe three three hundred so i'm gonna start painting like that and i'm gonna increase the brush size again by pressing alt key right click and drag right side this time we're gonna use maybe 400 we are going to decrease the opacity to maybe 20 percent paint and we're gonna increase the brush size again to maybe 500 um something like 550 and we're going to decrease the opacity again to maybe 10 yeah and we're going to paint again something like that now i know what you're thinking um this doesn't look glowy so we're going to select the layer this time and we're going to go to this blending mode and change this this uh the blending mode to color dodge 
uh, color dodge looks uh, great in this situation so I'm gonna use color dodge there it is now there's how you can make something glow inside of Photoshop if you want to take one step further um, you can copy this layer um, and put it down below the square so press alt key and left click this layer and drag it down and bring it over here and release it so that's going to like copy this layer here and it's gonna give a um, outer glow uh, on the square as well so the reason we are using the solid color like this is because we can always double click here and we can change the color anytime we want like something like that so this is a different color and we're, we can take the brush tool and sort of give some more colors something like that glowy make it even more glowy we want to give this um the feeling of there's a behind there is a, there's an at atmosphere um now if we double click here and change this to maybe something like that or okay so what you can do is you can change the color um blending mode to normal or color dodge add yep so now you can like play around with the colors now if you want um you can always spice things up a bit more um, by putting a background something like that hit enter and we're gonna bring it down to maybe here something like this and we're gonna change the blending mode to um i don't know maybe yep something like this it definitely uh, improved the design um if it doesn't you can always remove this all right guys um that is pretty much it um that is how you make the glow effect so i hope i'll see you guys in the next video um make sure to leave a like if you like this video and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already that would mean a lot to me so yeah i'll see you guys in the next video hopefully until then salam And now that I know my life's been such a blend